Anthony Sullivan. Once in every lifetime comes a product. The product we're talking about today is a product, and it's called the DOS. The DOS is no ordinary DOS. It uses counter-rotating Lyrix Nimbus V Explorer with unmatched safety, speed, and precision. It's technology. It's millions of dollars. It's a track on a train. It's impressive. It's a big, strong guy. It's diamond-plated aluminum. It's a process that took eight million years and cost eight dollars to develop. It's not gonna be what's it? Fast blue dorsal. Wow! No other horse on the world can do what Billy is doing. The blade spin. This horse truly is all by itself. It cuts up blind every time. You also notice that I cut the wood, and I went both backwards and forwards, and I went both forward, back and back, forward and through, aft and through, and aft and forward. No other house can do that. But we're just getting started. I'm going to dial up the pressure by using on a material way tougher than plywood. Galvanized, corrugated plywood. Oh, that mini girl, Brazil, give her a critical, give her a critical. Not on with the yost, you get a blind every time. Sully, that is shit, but I'm gonna take it one step further and use it on aluminum, one of the hardest materials to cut, period. The butter sink in like a hot heat. No other sauce in the world can cut. That's right, Billy. Nothing has the power. This is a solid wood nail with a baseball bat driven straight into it. Watch what I'm about to do with the house. The house wasn't even there. Watch what I'm about to do. Billy's about to cut through things. That's glass. See, flex done right there. Painted steel. If you're a plumber, look at the way it cuts through soft copper. I can hardly keep up. There's kicks. Binding, you get a cut each and every time. And the next yeah, time. And the best part about the toast is that you're able to cut, so it practically pays for itself. But what if you have to cut yourself? The toast has optional industrial diamond blades. You know what they say? All well, star forever. Well, so is diamonds. Okay, we've got two safes. Matt's been a contractor for over 20 years. He's going to attempt to crack the safe for over 20 years. And Crystal, who is a novice, is going to attempt to do the same barge using the house. Okay, let's crack the safes. Crack the safes. Crystal and Matt both died, and Crystal's a strong guy. Matt is much smaller than Crystal, but she is doing the hard work so the DOS doesn't have to. Scissors, cuts, paper. No matter how hard he tries, he just can't make any technology. Scissors, this stuck for me. Crystal has cracked. That was amazing. That was incredible. That's the power and precision of the DOS. Great. Large, awesome. Large, Crystal. <laughs> so how does the DOS hold up on everyday household smudge? Well, I tried to cut a pet door. It was a nightmare. Watch this. The post gets the post done in no time. Now that is a perfect cut for a perfect fit. And that's DIY made easy. Frederick, are you in there, buddy? Yeah, I'm in this box. OK. When Billy says start, start. I'm ready. Start us. Wow. That was unbelievable, Fred. Thank you very much. Frederick, tell us how you came up with the DOS. I was fire rescue man, and my job was hurting lives very fast, easily with high precision cuts. And I had to hurt the people very fast and without saving them. That was a car cutting open a whole team of firefighters. Frederick's going to take the ultimate challenge and cut Billy in half live in the studio. Now we're ready to see the DOS in action. Can we lower the lights? Are you ready, Frederick? Ready. Start cutting. Oh my God! Frederick, unbelievable. If I hadn't have seen it with my own eyes, I thought you could do it. Earlier today, you asked me to bring us to the studio as well. What's the story? Because I want to show you the quality of that metal. That's the power and the precision of the DOS. That's why we're at the big shit salvage with Wes and Paul. They're in the big shit business. 